Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for May 27th of 2024 is titled Chameleon One Molecular Cloud. So what do we see here? Well, here we see a region of the southern sky that is a region of active star formation. And we see a number of different things here associated with star formation, including the dark dusty nebula. And you can see those dark patches on the sky where it looks like nothing is present. However, it's not that it's that there's actually more material there. And in fact, enough material in terms of density to be able to block out the light from stars behind it. So a region in one of those dusty areas would have just as many stars behind it as other regions of the image. However, because of the dust there, it gets blocked out and we cannot see what is behind that section. So there are parts of the universe that we simply cannot see in this way. Now there are ways to look into it a little bit more and if we looked at this in the infrared it would give us a chance to kind of peek into those dark dusty clouds. Why does that occur? Well the infrared radiation is longer and that type of light is better able to penetrate through the dust and allow us to see. So whereas visible light does not get through infrared and radio waves could actually pass through this allowing us to see that bit of the universe behind that part of this dusty cloud. Now we also see a couple of reflection nebulae one up above a little bit and the blue one below reflection nebulae are the leftover dust around a young star that has formed and with the light will then scatter off that uh, that dust and gives it generally a bluish color although there are cases where we see other ones but the blue color is because dust scatters blue light much better than other wavelengths of light. However, depending on the specific type of star that happens to be there, sometimes we can get them looking more of a yellowish color as we see toward the top. Now the other nebula that we see here is the chameleon infrared nebula and that's down below that blue reflection nebula and that V shape of orange there. So it actually is formed by a relatively low mass star that has just formed and is kind of carving out that material around it. So much, much of this we see is associated with very recent star formation and in fact star formation that is still ongoing. So we'll see some newly formed stars here as we see within the reflection nebulae. We'll see and within the infrared nebula that we looked at. And we'll also see areas that are still beginning to just condense. And those are some of those darkest, dustiest knots. Those are still just in the process of beginning co to condense to form new stars. So over time, we will see more and more stars here as stars form from the dust and gas in this area and eventually will clean out the region, leaving behind a younger uh, what we call an open star cluster, which is really what is in the process of forming in a region like this. So that was our picture of the day for May 27th of 2024. It was titled Chameleon One Molecular Cloud. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Earth's big mystery crater. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.